Do you know what I don't understand? Someone in your family can be very toxic, causing you so many problems. Probably mean you no good. May even be jealous of you. Yet, someone in your family may tell you to not avoid the person, continue to speak to the person, be around the person, even though the person is very abusive. It seems like they don't really care about you being abused. What they may care about is having the image of a connected family. How senseless is that? This world is not perfect. Some things may not go the way you want it to grow, to go. You should not take abuse so that your family looks good by staying connected. If you are being abused, you should probably stay away from the person who is abusing you. If the person is outside of your family, some family members may tell you to stay away from that person. Makes sense. If the person is part of the family, they may tell you, well, that is your family and you need to stick with that person even though this and that is happening, makes absolutely no sense. Are they trying to tell you it is okay for family to abuse you, but not for an outsider to abuse you? Tell me if that makes any sense at all. Who cares about image if you are being abused? In this case, it may seem like they don't really care about your mental state, but they care more about image. That is toxic. I believe that is partly demonic as well. Very selfish too. For instance, I want people to think my family is connected. So even if there is abuse in the family, we are going to sweep it under the rug. We are not really going to deal with it because it may make us look bad if we deal with the abuse. Insanity makes no sense. You may have to escape a family like that, seriously. Some people may not be able to escape. Maybe they don't have a support link somewhere else. So some people may be, I guess I can say doomed to get abused, but you should take it to God. Pray about it. Ask God for a way out or to get the abuse to stop. This is really serious. Let me stop here. Be safe.